Tesla have revealed what is a surprisingly simple product, but apparently they've actually been working on this for several years. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. I'm Sam Evans. You're watching The Electric Viking. Great to see you. Now, I just want to say a big thank you to all of you who have, um, you know, sent me emails or, you know, made nice comments uh, wishing me to um, get better from my injuries. <laughs> here's, here's some of them. That's about, about half of them. Anyway, they seem to be healing pretty well. So that's, that's kind of nice. Anyway, Tesla, what's going on? Tesla have revealed a new tire repair kit. It's a real product. Apparently it works. Tesla have been working on it for a few years. It looks very simple to me. I don't understand why it's taken so long. But anyway, here are the details. You can finally buy this tire repair kit. Um, and after promising a release, in several months for around two years, Tesla's new tire repair kit has appeared on online in stock on Tesla's website. Price, 125 US dollars. Other countries, the price is gonna be different, of course. It comes with an 80 PSI air compressor with a flow rate of 25 liters per minute and a connector to the 12 volt port. The tire repair kit comes with the usual bottle of sealant and Tesla says it is rated to fix holes in the tread of your tires that are six millimeters or less in diameter. Six millimeter hole is not a, not a huge hole. I mean, it's less than a centimeter, but this is pretty standard for most tire repair kits. Tesla advises that the new tire kit is only for emergency repairs. So tires fixed with the sealant and then inflated shouldn't be driven more than 62 miles. One advice that is pretty often ignored in emergencies. So honestly, I've driven tires using these kinds of repairs for years. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have. I've actually been to tire shops where they've done a so so-called uh, temporary fix. Um, one of the reasons was I couldn't get the wheel off my car. The, the bolts, uh, there was a problem with the bolts. We couldn't get them off someone over tightened them with a ratchet gun to an insane level and there was no tire shop that could remove it so i had to put uh, it got a puncture i had to use a temporary repair kit and the temporary plug lasted for i think it was about two and a half years and by then we're able to work out how to get the tire off and anyway um, we're able to solve the issue which was a bit of a pain in the backside but just to know um, if you have got a temporary repair it, it, it doesn't necessarily have to be changed. It doesn't mean you need a new tire. Unfortunately, the new tire repair kit comes with inflation and not of the air pumping type, but rather with the one accumulated since 2021 when Tesla said it would launch in a few months. The 80 PSI compressor that shouldn't be operated for more than half an hour, plus the sealant and the box they go into are now uh, about twice the price of what they used to be, and apparently it is better than the previous Tesla um, repair kit. The 2024 Tesla tire repair kit is you can buy them on Amazon right now for $125 or you can buy them straight from Tesla. And you can also get a tire protection plan for $35 a year um, from Tesla themselves. So that could be an option. Now, do I recommend getting it for $125? I've actually bought other brand repair kits and I found that they didn't last that long. I bought a, a couple of others on um, eBay and Amazon. I found that didn't last that long. So probably a better option to get something that might last longer and work better than some of the um, non-branded repair kits that are out there. Guys, what are your thoughts on this one? Is it worth the outlay in your opinion, the $125? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.